Yeah, this is recording. Okay. What's up? So, I hope you can hear me. My family's out there, so. Yeah. As you can see, this is a haul like thing from Christmas. And a song you just heard, if you like that kind of music, it is um, a cover from First to Last, Ride the Wings of Pestilence. It's by Kay Anagonio. Her URL will be down below, but her screen name is Kay the Female Screamer Official, and then she has a vlog channel, somewhat vlog channel. She does twice weekly adventure videos, and on Friday she does LGBT topics, so yeah, and that is just the letter K. That will also be down there in the description, so. Dr. Pepper. So let's get started on this tack haul slash Christmas thing. So this is everything that I got for Christmas and then for my mom and then I have stuff that my dad got me which was just money that I bought stuff with which is coming in the mail. So yeah, yeah so let's get started. I got two Himalayan salt, salt rocks so yeah. Nice, and then I got. I didn't get much. I got the carrots, overreach breeches, and tan. These are actually really good. If you want me to review these, I actually will review everything if you want me to. So just like the video. I really hope I am in focus, and I really hope I am in frame. Uh, so I got these carrots, overreach bre breeches, full seats. So yeah. These were actually really comfortable. I haven't ridden in them yet, but you know. Oh, and I have a sock bottom, which is the best thing ever, because no one likes that Velcro shit. Also, excuse my language, I swear a lot. <laughs> it's an unhealthy amount. So, I also need to iron these. So, got these. And then I got. These are just for underneath my pants when I ride because I ride in a very cold climate in the winter. I live in New Hampshire and right now it is actually, let me tell you the weather. It is 12 degrees where I live and then where my horse is, it is, I should have checked that already, where my horse is because I board him up in a different town, it is 9 degrees. So, which it probably feels less than that. So, just these. And these are actually really comfortable to wear underneath any type of breech in the winter. I wear these all the time. Well, this type of stuff all the time under me, underneath my Piper breeches. So, that's nice. And then I got this Ariat uh, Quarter Zip Lowell. I think that's how you pronounce it. Not sure. It's just in white. So, yep, so it's nice and comfy. I got a Happy Mouth bit. I got a Happy Mouth double ring snaffle, I believe that's the name. If that's wrong, please correct me. So, yeah. And I ride my horse in a very soft bit, even though he needs to be a little more heavy handed. I just personally don't like being hard on his mouth because he is sensitive and then let's try not to show my address on this and then the next thing that I got is oops, let me take off that oh and by the way all the equine stuff I got from well my mom got from <sighs> smart pack and then I just got this back on track therapeutic um, saddle pad this is actually my horse's first saddle pad. I just been borrowing saddle pads from the barn and it just looks like this. It's black, has your billet strap and then your, I forgot what this is called, but yeah. This is, so this, since this is back on track it has the Welltex fabric underneath. So yeah, this, I hope he will like this because my horse has a very sensitive back and he likes to be warm even though he is already warm already. He's like me. 
he literally has the same exact attitude as me that I'm having that day. So like, if I'm mad, he's also mad. He's like me. He doesn't like to take anybody's crap. He doesn't like to be contained. So yeah, I got this for him. Let me just put this back. And then I'll show you. I also got another thing. It was the Rokul Winter Chester Gloves. And those are coming in the mail because they were uh, back ordered by the time that my mom bought them for me. So you will be seeing that in the next couple of videos, days, and whatnot. And then I just got something from Amazon. Okay. Okay. So I got a Funko Pop. I love Funkos. I collect Funkos. I have a bunch of Funkos, and my family might be getting a cat soon. Another cat. We might actually be getting a Mancoon. So. I don't like to take them out of the boxes, but I'll take this one out of the box to show you. Yeah. Okay. Literally this came just as I was about to hit record. My mom came in and she was like, hey, this came for you. So here is the mancoon. I really hope this is focusing. Because the camera oop, the camera that I have, um, it doesn't have a screen for me to tell if it's in focus. So I just got the Mancoon from the Pets line. This is the third Funko I have from the Pets line. I have um, the Husky and the German Shepherd. This is my first cat and there are, there's the Mancoon, the Siamese, and the Calico. So that's that. I was literally about to close the box by opening back the fun code. If you guys want, I uh, can. Oh, one sec. If you guys would like, I can do a uh, Funko Pop collection. I don't have that many. I do. I don't have that many compared to other YouTubers and stuff like that and other people. I have a pretty good amount but sadly a few of my Funko Bobs got into the hands of my baby sister and she wrecked the boxes and broke the Funkos which I was very sad about so yeah and I'm trying to think if I'm forgetting anything I don't think I'm forgetting anything no I'm not but um I will be getting a few more things in the mail, which I will show another one. So, yeah, I hope you guys like this. And Kay Anagonio's stuff will be down in the description. Also, my name is Sam. Nice to meet you. And if you guys want any type of video, like request of videos, just comment down below. And also, if any of you want to leave hate, that's cool. It won't bother me. So yeah. Have an IF day, I guess. I don't know. My back edges. Bye.